Hi, and welcome to our channel. So, what is Zcash? You've probably heard a lot about cryptocurrency and its supposed privacy benefits. Zcash cryptocurrency has firmly taken its place in the digital market, offering users unique solutions. Given its high level of privacy, it has attracted the interest of many crypto enthusiasts who prefer to work anonymously. However, when you delve into the technology, you will encounter many complex concepts. We'll tell you more about Zcash in this video. Watch carefully so you don't miss out on a lot of useful information. Zcash appeared relatively recently, in late October 2016. It is traded on exchanges under the ticker ZEC. Zuko Wilcox and his company were involved in the creation of Zcash and the best cryptographers in the world were involved in the work. The development of this coin began four years before its release. After that, their creation was officially presented a completely anonymous cryptocurrency, Zcash. ZEC was created based on the new protocol, ZK Snark. This is the so-called Zero Disclosure Protocol, the main advantage of which is the complete anonymity of transaction participants and the network as a whole. The whole history of transaction is qualitatively encrypted and impossible to recognize by third parties. Therefore, users can make direct transfers between themselves and no one else will know who transferred how much to whom. With a special built-in algorithm, transactions are confirmed automatically. At the same time, their anonymity is easily proven mathematically. Such a thing has not been seen in the world of cryptocurrencies yet. To make a payment in the system, a person needs only to enter an individual script, other transactions are made by the system. When a wallet is created, the system gives the user a hidden and public script. The hidden script provides the most anonymous transactions, while the public script allows others to verify them if circumstances require it. The features of the system don't end here. Unlike Bitcoin and similar cryptocurrencies, all transfer data is completely deleted without being saved anywhere. While the Bitcoin network still allows to somehow identify who received and sent the transfer. Zcash does not. The system zeros always reset the transaction data. Zcash cryptocurrency has firmly taken its place in the digital market, offering users unique solutions. Given its high level of privacy, it has attracted the interest of many crypto enthusiasts who prefer to work anonymously. Like Bitcoin, it is a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer electronic money. It is also a tight limit of 21 million coins hard-coded in its protocol. However, this is where the similarities end. Zcash was designed specifically for anonymous transactions that are private and interchangeable. It was branched out from Bitcoin by Zuko Wilcox, who wanted to create a private cryptocurrency. It was originally called Zero Coin until it was renamed. They can solve the dilemma of verifiability and privacy by using their revolutionary ZK Snark protocol. This was developed for the Zcash protocol, and they can prove that the transaction is valid without public disclosure of the inputs and outputs. The technology has enabled a transaction that can completely hide the wallet address of both the sender and the recipient. They also hide the amount of the transaction and the only information stored in the timestamp. However, there is one important thing that should be not discarded. Started. Although Zcash is private, it can be private. This means that users will have to participate in private transactions. Zcash cryptocurrency is equipped with the ZK Snarks protocol, which together with the decentralized network allows hiding the identity of the sender and recipient, as well as the amount of the transactions. At the same time, the user has the right to choose whether to hide information about himself or not. The client can use two types of wallets offered by the official software of the system, public and private. Thus, the transaction can be fully or partially open, or it can be completely anonymous if the transfer is between two private wallets. In the latter case, the only information that will be available to an outside party is the amount of commission paid. 
The Zcash protocol protects the inputs and outputs of a transaction and therefore ensures that no information is made publicly available to the blockchain. To verify that someone is authorized to spend a certain amount of Zcash, the protocol uses ZK-SNARK. This allows the transaction metadata to be encrypted and ZK-SNARKs are used to verify that no one is cheating or stealing. ZK-SNARKs are based on a complex cryptographic principle called Zero Disclosure Proof. These proofs are mainly used to verify that someone has a secret without revealing it. Zcash is a proof-of-work blockchain. This means they are mined just like Bitcoin using raw processing power. Miners will use hash functions to solve complex mathematical problems and therefore be rewarded per block. While Bitcoin uses the SHA-256 hashing function, Zcash has chosen to use Equihash. Both coins have a total availability supply of over 21 million coins to mine. These days, however, mining Zcash is much easier than mining Bitcoin. In fact, until recently, Zcash could be mined using conventional GPUs. Only when Bitmain began developing the Antimeter Z9, competitive ZEC mining became impossible. Unlike several other cryptocurrency projects, Zcash did not hold an ICO. Instead, they chose a different incentive mechanism for founders. This is through what is called a founder's reward. The founder's reward is 10% of all mining rewards within four years of creation. It is divided according to the breakdown above. It it will be passed on to founders, investors and advisors in stages of the four years. If you calculate this, it turns out that a total of 2.1 million ZEC will be transferred to the founders over 10 years. This mining tax is not uncontroversial and is the reason for some forks on the Zcash chain. The reward per block in the Zcash blockchain will be halved every four years. Although Zcash is supposed to be completely confidential, people can check exactly how much money has been sent to private addresses. This is accomplished through the use of view buttons and notes. If someone holds your view key, they can unprotect your secure transactions. When they view transaction data with a view key, not only can they tell how much was spent, but they can also see who their recipients are. There is also what is called a MIMO field. This MIMO field will contain information only available to the recipient of the transaction. This MIMO field can contain financial data that can be sent to other financial institutions if required by law. The creators of Zcash hoped that this could increase the distribution of Zcash among government-regulated entities. However, this could be a double-edged sword for those concerned that their transaction metadata is anywhere. Essentially, to get snark public parameters, you need public and private key pairs. Once this is done, the creators will destroy the private key and keep the public counterpart. With this private key, the owner can create a completely fake ZEC. What's more, no one would even notice that they are forgeries. Normally, this is not a problem of public blockchains such as Bitcoin, etc. However, with Zcash, no one can confirm that this does not happen. So this is a problem with the Zcash ecosystem, and we get the notion of toxic waste. As Wilcox describes it, we call the private key toxic waste, and our protocol is designed to ensure that toxic waste never comes to light. So to prevent this toxic waste, the Zcash team needs to make sure that they keep all the components of the private key separate and destroy them separately. They need to be certain that the various parts of the private key do not combine to form toxic waste. While Zcash is without a doubt one of the most advanced privacy coins on the market, it has its share of skeptics. There are several things that people inside and outside the community disagree with. One of the most pertinent is the optional privacy of transactions. It creates an uncomfortable situation where one person's use of a transparent address can compromise another person's perceived privacy. This is because private transactions with a Z address can be viewed suspiciously by outsiders. 
it is possible to perform what is called traffic analysis. For example, if you send 4.89ZEC to a secure address and then immediately send 4.89ZEC to an unshielded address, someone can link the latter transaction to the former. The optional privacy riddle has been a problem that other privacy coins have encountered. Monero, Zcash's main competitor, decided to make all of its transactions mandatory with privacy. Consequently, if someone sends transactions using Monero, they automatically become private. The advantage of this is that one user's carelessness does not affect the privacy of another. ZEC cryptocurrency mining is a complex issue that split the community in late 2016. For the first 34 days, the principle of slow start mining was implemented to detect and correct errors. It was very difficult to mine the first 20,000 blocks, which greatly hampered the development of the network. In addition, it was stipulated that within four years, the developers received 20% of the value of each mine block. This increased the price of the block and decreased the interest of investors. The result was a hard fork, which resulted in a new cryptocurrency separated from Zcash, Z Classic. In Classic, these problems were eliminated, after which the fork began to live its own life. After the end of the slow start, the reward for Zcash miners was set at 12.5 ZEC per block, which will decrease to 6.25 ZEC after calculating 840,000 blocks. Cryptocurrency mining parameters are as follows. The POW protocol on the Equihash algorithm is applied. The limit of coins is limited to 21 million units. The founder's reward is 10% of each block. ZEC can be mined both on a powerful processor and on video cards. The latter is preferable as it enables mining other digital currencies as well. NVIDIA and AMD are best suited for mining. You can mine blocks using Linux and Windows 64-bit software. It is important to choose the right miner for the most effective work. Zcash mining prospects look like for many other cryptocurrencies. Single miners and home farms will gradually recede, giving way to miners who can form large farms from high-performance video cards. Also, there will be demand for cloud mining services, renting out power. Zcash is among the top 50 cryptocurrencies by market capitalization. Zcash is a fairly liquid cryptocurrency listed on several exchanges. For example, you can buy it on HitBTC, Huobi, and Binance Exchange. However, these are only cryptocurrency exchanges, which means you have to buy bitcoins for your fiat on some other exchanges. The easiest way to buy ZEC is through cryptocurrency exchange. You can exchange BTC or ETH for ZEC, or you can use fiat currency directly. Zcash is one of the most successful and oldest cryptocurrencies, so it is represented on almost all the exchanges. You can also sell there. The fiat currency you receive in exchange will top up your account in your payment system, whether it's an online wallet or a credit card. When choosing an exchange to work with Zcash, you need to consider many factors. The number of commissions, trading volume, reputation, and most importantly, security. There are specialized exchanges for ZEC, which use the cryptocurrency's built-in ability of absolute anonymity. The following exchanges will completely hide the fact of purchase from everyone. Germany, The Rock Trading, and Flip.me. The amount of your transaction or your online address. Everything will look like a normal transparent transfer. Centralized exchanges are a constant target for hackers and attackers, so be sure to familiarize yourself with their security measures before trusting them with your money. Thanks for watching this video. Check out the channel for more videos.